Hey everyone, I'm Ricky, and today I'm going to be watching Elite Season 3, Episode 7, entitled Nadia and Omar. The last time on Elite, Rebecca got what was coming to her. She, you know, started dealing all the drugs. I knew that when she said, I want to flush these down the toilet, I knew she was going to get caught before it happened. And sure enough, she did. They fell out of her pocket after Sam was beating the crap out of Polo, after Polo confronted Valerio because he thought that Valerio gave... Carla the drugs that made her pass out in a pool and almost die, but it was actually Rebecca. So there's a lot going on last episode, but the season's getting crazy, and I love it. Lou and Nadia's relationship is uh, going really well, and I really like it. They both got accepted into the scholarship, which I'm assuming Polo is going to ruin, which is why Lou hates him. And threw that glass in his face, or not the glass, but she threw a drink in his face. I was just saying last episode about how we haven't had an episode with Nadia yet, and it's coming up right now, so I'm interested to see what their dynamic is and what they have to say uh, during this night. I know Omar was told by Ander that Ander did it, even though I'm not sure if that's necessarily true. And also Nadia told Lou that she needs to lie, probably to protect her future. Like there's, I think Nadia is trying to protect her from something. I think that a lot of people probably saw what happened and know who did it. Carla hid the bo wine bottle and then disposed of it, the one that Polo was stabbed with. Ander lied, I guess, in Omar's eyes, he lied, saying that he saw Guzman stab Polo. I think he said stab. Rebecca said that she saw Sam go into the bathroom after Polo, right before he got stabbed, which could be just a retaliation thing against Sam. Omar and Ander, ugh. It's, it's honestly so sad. They broke up last episode. I hope that doesn't last too long. Omar's kind of seeing Malik, and then Ander is seeing this guy, Alexis, who he's in chemo treatment with. Do I think that's gonna last through season four? Probably not. I want. I just wanna know who did it, honestly, at this point. I don't wanna guess yet. I wanna wait until the finale episode, which is the next one, but until then, let's just watch this one. Oh, they're kissing. We like this, okay. Cause she basically was telling him that like they they would never be a thing. Oh no, this is before, okay. Oh, he had his, he had his fist, in a, fist in a ball. Is that ball in a fist? How do you say that? He probably had something to prove when he went there. There was something that he was going to do. He looked like he was ready to start some shit. Oh god, something's going on. <laughs> oh, that would be nice. <laughs> that would be really nice if they did that. I mean, I don't think they're gonna leave. <laughs> Omar! You just met the guy. <sighs> I don't know. I, I'm not going to be into Omar and Malik together if they end up together. It's just not going to happen for me. Oh, yeah. All four of them? Yeah, Sam doesn't care about the big guys. <laughs> Sassy. Why did they expel Guzman too? Sam's right. He's right. Oh, he shouldn't say it, but he's right. Yeah, I knew he fucked up the scholarship for them. Or maybe his mom's did, I don't know. At least she's owning up to it. I wonder who that was from, though. It made a point to show that she was getting a text or a call from somebody. She, uh, he's the, he is the one that started it, so he should apologize. <laughs> oh, damn. Well, Valeria has even more and more of a reason to want to kill Polo as the episodes go on, so I'm just- I'm still assuming it's not him just because of that. 
Are they real? Is this show really trying to pass him off as 17 years old? Like, at least make him 18. <laughs> He looks like he's like 27. And the thing is too is like I knew the show was gonna make it so that the characters couldn't move on with their lives. They had to keep them together because if they're gonna do, be doing five seasons they need to have all the characters together. So expelling four people at one time I guess is a good way to do it and also getting two other scholarships messed up too. He needs to stop saying that. He needs to stop. Good. She shouldn't. Ander, oh my god, dude. No one has given you a death date. No one said you're gonna, you have six months to live. Unless maybe we don't know about it. But god damn, is he beating himself up right now. You know what would be so random is if Yurai was the one to kill Paulo or Malik. Just like one of the newer characters just randomly just killed him. I hope I don't eat my words in saying that because I think that would be kind of stupid. It would be a lot more interesting if one of the main people did it. <laughs> I, can't, I don't think I can see Omar killing anybody either. I did see Andrew walking up to them though, so there might have been a, more of a scene after that. I don't know. Oh, okay, that's what that was. Her mom's training her to be a drug pusher now. That's bad. That's gonna be bad for Rebecca. They're, that only means bad things, probably. Oh. They keep doing that. She keeps saying something about, like, you're not man enough. Like, first of all, who are you to say that? Ugh, that kind of means that his mom's made him go to a place that he didn't want to go, only for him to end up dying. I bet if there's going to be some sort of investigation, his moms are going to be a force to be reckoned with next season. Carla is so good, I love her. Carla stays being a bad bitch all day, every day. Yep. She said it herself, they didn't fit together until Valerio came in, so that means that them together just doesn't work, yeah. Polo wisening up the day that he dies is so insane to me. It's true. That's why she fell so- I think that's part of the reason why she fell so hard for him in the first place. And for all this, you hit a murder weapon! Dumb bitch. <laughs> Good for him! Oh, uh, well, I mean, that's annoying that her dad gets what he wants, but it's to help Carl out. That's so nice of him. Oh, they're both conflicted. They're both morally- they, they have moral compasses that are bigger than that. Oh, I wonder if they're gonna decline it on stage. Oh my god, I'm ready! Woo! Oh, look at them all happy. You're about to be mad in a second. Oh my god, I don't know if I'm ready for this. Or, wait, but she's not at Polo. Does Polo do something? <laughs> yes! Oh, oh, I was hoping she would bring her up. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, no, we knew that. We we knew that was gonna happen. Alright, who's he gonna say now? Nadia. Uh, 
I was joking. They have to be covering up for somebody. They have to be making it so that everything gets so jumbled. I don't know. Nadia and Lou, oh my god. This show is so good, and Lou and Nadia are fucking badass. Carla, Nadia, Lou, MVPs. Uh, of course. Sam is always against the patriarchy. Ooh, what's that? What's that? What's that? Carla? Yes! Yes! Oh! Oh! Yo, your eye? That was, that's fucking awesome. Yeah, now you're fucked, dude. She's smarter than you, dude. Yes! 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 Oh my god. Yes. Oh, I don't know if he signed or not. That's awesome, though. Is he gonna admit what he did? Good for him, honestly. I, I did not expect this. Holy shit. So the scholarship is back on. Why would he go to this party though? Is he an idiot? Oh my God, I love that they're getting back together. Yes, good question, good question, good question, good question. This, okay, this needed to happen. This is so right. I love this. <laughs> They're like, fuck off. We need, we need this moment. Ah. Oh. I love this. Get your mouth off of there. I, this is pre-COVID, but that's nasty. That is so not right. Like, Nadia and Guzman is amazing, and this is just a train wreck that needs to be fixed. I know it's probably not going to be fixed this season, but at least next season. Kiss him. No. I thought they were going to make up. <laughs> and this is when o uh, Polo comes in. Oh, the song. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so excited to watch the last episode now. I've, I've warmed up to this idea. I used to think this was just so not a, the right thing, but... Oh. And now Polo. Enter Polo! Yeah, cast come together! Avengers assemble! Ah, <laughs> uh, perfect cast. Perfect cast. Oh, I love that shot too. That was a good ending. I, I'm so excited! <laughs> they did such a good job this season of making it so that everyone has a reason to kill Polo. A anybody could be the one to do it, and I love this. I think this is the first time where I can say I have absolutely no clue on who actually did it. I guess final predictions. Um, I'm gonna say who I don't think it is. Don't think it's Sam, because that would be too obvious. I don't think it's Valerio, because that would be too obvious. Carla had blood on her hands, but I don't think she's the one to stab him. Maybe she pushed him out of the window, I don't know. I'm going to assume a guy stabbed him in the bathroom, but I don't know what happened upstairs with the through the window thing. Like, the glass was already cracked, so he may have just fell through, I guess, but I, someone must have done something. The fact that everyone's blaming everybody else for it is making me think that everyone knows who did it, but are trying to cover it up for them. And it may be Ander, I don't know. You know, everyone's sympathetic to Ander, he doesn't have any enemies. But it wouldn't make sense that Ander stabbed him. Like, I, I think that maybe he would say that to help cover somebody else's tracks. 
I can see Rebecca doing it, but she seems pretty set. I don't know. I don't think she has too much of a grudge against Polo, so I would say not her, but I'm gonna leave her out too. I don't think it's her. I don't think it's Omar, but he doesn't really have like a good reason to. Polo had a reason to. He would do anything for Carla in the first season. He knew about the watches and everything and how it was gonna destroy Car Carla's life and he was obsessed with her. So, you know, that led to the whole conclusion where he killed her. And I guess I'm ruling out people who would have a very good reason to do so, but the first season didn't make it very clear that it was going to be Polo. Like it made it clear that it could be other people but not him, so so that's why I'm ruling out the obvious people. Guzman could be the one to do it, honestly. I think it would be very satisfying if he did it. I think that the, the show's done a good job of making it seem like he won't do it now because he's not forgiven him, but he's forgotten about him, doesn't want anything to do with him. He's just like, whatever, I've moved on. That's a perfect way to get all suspicion off of him, right? So, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna say it. I, I think it's Guzman. We're gonna, or I hope, okay, I'm just gonna say that. I kind of hope it is, because it would be such perfect, sweet justice for Barina. If it were somebody else, it would be, it would still be interesting, I would like it, but like if Kai did it, it'd be like, holy shit, what, like, I mean, I, she is kind of psycho for agreeing to hide a murder weapon for someone who he, she knows that he killed, but I mean, she did that for money, so. I don't think it would be her. Anyways, all right, I, I need to I need to stop before I go on a, a whole long tangent. But that was uh, the seventh episode, and I'm about to watch the finale, and I'm so excited! Let me know what you thought about this episode. Let me know in the comments um, who did you think it was going to be before, like at this point, like right before the finale, who'd you think it was going to be? By this point, by the time I upload this, I will have already watched the finale, so if you spoil it, that's fine. But let me know who you thought it was going to be, like before knowing. That's my final guess. Is goes on. I don't want to be wrong, but I, I don't know. I think that would be, I think that would be such a good ending. It would be very shocking if Carla like lost her cool or Lou or Nadia, you know, those people, it would be like that. It, it would seem out of character for all of them, but it could happen. So yeah, let me know what you thought and um, I will see you on the finale. Bye.